You're watching Pettidendron. In today's video, I'm at Southern California's Carnivorous Plant Enthusiasts. And it is crazy. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if you're new here, hi, welcome. I'm Patrick and I'm a houseplant collector, enthusiast, hobbyist, and I upload every Sunday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. So if you want to see how I grow my collection and keep my plants happy, then you should definitely hit subscribe. In today's video, I'm excited to be checking out all of these carnivorous plants. I'm here at Rainforest Flora. They're having a meet with Southern California's carnivorous plant enthusiast group. And I'm so excited to show you guys all these really cool plants. So let's get to it. All right, look at this. We're at the first table and they have some beautiful... Yeah, some really, really that's kind of plants. We have a bunch of different Venus flytraps, the Dianea. Um, this one's the BCP Z11. It's got really big traps. And the Drosera or the Sundew. Actually, I want to see. I think they're so cute. This one's $15. Let's just um, check out all of the, the goodies. Oh, this one's 10 <laughs> But I like uh, one of my favorites too, Star. It's kind of like biohazard. Oh, it's kind of like uh, make little like juicy little colors, right? Well, it, it's just the end of the, these traps. The edge of the trap. It's so cool. So this one is on my radar. The B52. Look at how big these. Traps are. Oh, awesome. Mind opened up a couple of days ago, man. And here is another vendor. Look at that with the pink wiggles or the butter warts. I think Saracenias are so beautiful. And look at this Drosera or Sundew. That is so cool. Maybe I'll just take one of these yeah. and then... And try it out first. Is there one for like... Oh my gosh, look at this flower. This guy here? That's awesome. Okay. But, uh, I've never seen are, um, such uh, big Saracenia flowers. Uh, there are people that grow it out. It's outside in the spray. It's possible. I haven't done it. But uh, yeah, this is also the same time as the Sarah. Like the bathroom, like a steamy bathroom or something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And again, supplement the lighting. And some fly traps over here. Uh, this guy's here? So this is oh, okay. the yes. vendor, Beauties and Beasts by Braulio. These are um, special fabrics. This one's really cute. All right, so this is Maggie's Shop of Horror. <laughs> That's a great name. They have a bunch of different types of carnivorous plants. They have some Saracenias. I'm obsessed with these Saracenia flowers. Beautiful plants. And a bunch of different fly traps too. Different cultivars. And some Nepenthes too. Look at those red pictures right there. Wow. Look at these pictures. 
And these beautiful ripple leaves. That is so cool. Look at the tiniest little Nepenthes. These are uh, maybe like three inch pot. And they're so cute. This is not big for liking it. Here's some sundews or droseras. So this is still starting, it starts still like this. Look at these, they're so cute. I love the color. And the bright red insides of the trap. This is called the red piranha. It said an hour and sixteen minutes. So this is another vendor here. And this is like I don't know. So far, Sundu Central. I love these. The Drosera Scorpioides. And this one's really interesting too. The Drosera Dreamsicle. She was just telling me that this one gets full sun. And look at these late little baby pinguicolas. Sandy, right? Alright, you're set. Yep. Very good. Thank you. Ooh, look. Do you want a I love, tray or a little tray? I love this sun stressing on that. All right, so here is another one. These little orchids, but um, he was just telling me that these are the Drosera capensis albino form, and the flowers are white, and also the tentacles are white. And these are all so cool. They're all five dollars. Check out his nepenthes. Right there. Well, you gotta have All right. This one says that most of the plants here are ten to twenty dollars, unless it's otherwise marked. I like looking at these little ones right here. Those Draceras are so cute. I do do PayPal. Yeah. Okay. So that's twenty. Here are more. Ten bucks each. And then look at all the Saracenias. Eight. M -R beautiful. These pictures are. And here is another one, exoticcarnivores.com. And you know, these picture plants are next level. They're gorgeous. Yeah. So yeah. Let's check this out. Yeah. I'm not sure what the issue is with that, but uh, probably. Look at these. These are so cute. I'm loving the red venation on these pictures. And look at these. Oh my gosh. These are beautiful. Oh my god. I can't believe how much attention he's got. I'm, I'm really not letting him go today. I, I bought him five months ago. I love just that. Immediately said yes. Striped rim. And, uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm glad he knows. On these, they're so pretty. But yeah, I, I should just hang on to these are 20 These are such this amazing plants. Uh, this would be an easy. I think you could grow these from probably out. I don't know a fan of a window sill for that, but outside, you know, three hours. So here's another one. Uh, these are carnivorous bromeliads. And he was just telling me that there were how many? Like three, three yeah, species, three species of, of carnivorous. That's so cool. 
And then look at these, these Droceras right here. So this one's called the Saracenia Leucophila. Loving these like huge pictures. Saracenia Leucophila. Leucophilia. That's Tomato, tomato. And some more. Oh, look at that. Yes. Yes. I know. Oh, and here's another. Leucophila or Leucophila. I was part of the last two. See, I think uh, Saracenias are so pretty. And they have some. Venus flytraps, too. Okay, so this is a super cool flytrap. So this is a mutant, and it's called the mirror because the traps are like two or three-headed usually, and that's so cool. These must look really neat when they're huge. That was crazy fun and that's it for today's video but first let me show you all the plants that I got so these are all the goodies can you tell that I had fun <laughs> I'm super excited this is the Drosera Adele giant I heard this gets super big this is the Drosera Scorpioides and this is beautiful there's like so many different plants in there. They're all the Drosera scorpioides. Droseras are also known as sundews and they catch their prey with, by luring, I think, <laughs> by luring insects with the dew on their little hairs. And then I also got this pinguicola Aphrodite. It has little um, Droceras in there. So I feel like I got a really good deal because I got some free stowaway plants. And then you won't believe I won this Dianea or a Venus flytrap. It's the B-52 and it's crazy because I was actually just like asking about the B-52 because I have the King Henry at home and wow, I manifested it. <laughs> I can't believe I won this in the raffle. Shout out to Michelle from Southern California Carnivorous Plant Enthusiasts for picking my ticket. <laughs> and. I also got this, the mirror Venus flytrap, the fact that it had, you know, two, three heads per trap super intrigued me. And she says that hers are stable, so I guess it's like a mutation and sometimes they revert back but hers don't. And Whenever I hear stable doesn't revert back, I'm like, ooh, sold. <laughs> Isn't that cool? Oh, and also, I got this begonia from Jimmy from Verdant Vivariums. That was so nice of him. And it was super nice to see him too. So Jimmy, if you're watching this, thank you so much and shout out and also, another shout out to uh, Anthony from Plantitas. It was so cool running into him at this event. And I feel like we're both falling down <laughs> this rabbit hole of carnivorous plants together. So that's cool. So yeah, that's all the plants I got. 
As you can see, I had a lot of fun and I hope you did too. And if you like this video, you know what to do. Please throw me a bone and give me a thumbs up. And if you want to support my channel and see more of my plant videos, which I hope you do, please, please, please hit that subscribe button. And I can't wait to see you in the next video. I just don't want to miss you too much. So if you could show me some love in the comments and I'll meet you there. Bye.